Hey guys, it's Mac. We have Blaine's little project going on here, obviously, but it's a little snow covered right now. Got plenty of work to do on it though. Fenders are off. That's it. But that's not the main project for today. We actually have to pull my dad's truck apart for just a little bit of a engine swap, you know? So he's cleaning that out up here in the shop back here. But that's about all we got for today. So we're gonna film a little bit of us taking that out. Blaine is currently in Kansas or driving back by now. So we have that going and truck's just being washed right now before we take that engine out. So yeah. See, here we go. Get it all cleaned up. We just made it to the shop, pulled the truck in here, got the door, and then we're gonna pull that aluminum trailer home here with the Dodge that I drove over. But time to get to work. Start pulling this apart and then get it out of there. And then Thursday, the plan is to have another motor to put in there that we're gonna call back from our, our friends. So, yeah. Good little week project, hopefully. So we're starting with, we're gonna take the hood off. And then uh, pretty soon here we'll have coolant drains and um, pressure sucked out, all that. And then we'll really get going on pulling the, everything out and apart. We realized, or I guess I just realized, we're gonna LS swap it and put a turbo on it. Yeah. And change fuel systems because there's two tanks. Oh, good. So we can make one a race tank and then one just a regular gas tank. It won't be a race truck though, it's still a daily driver. So now we got this being jacked up so we can start looking for fuel lines and then pulling it out. We have the fan and the um, fan cover off. Most um, wires and everything taped off too, see? And then uh, everything's drained. Uh, I guess not oil, but coolant is. So we're getting closer, really close. So down here, Dad is working on getting the trans. Well, the converter pulled out. Right there. Okay, so see, I need so, you to hold this. Right okay. There. See how it's in the teeth? Yep. So hold that and I'll loosen this baby up. So, still getting that going. And up top, we got a chain on it, ready to be pulled out. And then we should be pretty close. Yeah, we're getting there. Yeah. Cutting some exhaust here. So, that's a plus. Get that out of the way.
have another engine right here for mock-up. And we're just setting it in there, see what we're gonna need to order, what parts we're gonna need to get. This is uh, off Just Justin's old uh, trailblazer. Yep. <clears throat> oh yeah, I got dowel problems in the back, so it's like gonna go. So we need to like tip it. We need to go up, tip it down into the dowel holes. Or maybe we ought to just get a jack and we'll jack the front of the trans up. Yeah, it works. Okay. I got one right here somewhere. So, just checking for that. So this is not the engine that we're putting in there. But we are trying to check it for the other one that we're gonna get Thursday. And we're gonna line the trans up with it. And see what we need to get. Looks like everything's gonna work so far, but that's not always the case. We're a little bit farther on our process here. Um, start with, yeah, it fits. It fits. I can go and went right in. Uh, exhaust head folds fit upside down too, because we're going to plan on putting the turbo in here. Um, brackets all fit, the fan's going to fit, the shroud even's going to fit. Like, it's going to work so far, so that's pretty big. And it's only like mm, not even six o'clock yet. We started around 1.30, 2 o'clock. So it worked fast. That's something a little bit different. the motor yesterday so pick her up check out what we got here got a broken exhaust bolt yeah that's a fun one it's fine anyway got, got our a, icon motion yep. racer it's icon throttle body mounted up yeah the hope is to put a little boost on this thing yeah let's go show where we're gonna but, do uh, that this is just factory see that yeah that's factory for sure uh okay let's go show them the truck Anyway, we got a little mock-up motor in there right now. There's the, uh... We pulled that one out. That was going to be in there first, but no, not nope. anymore. So anyway. Get up here on the step ladder, because you're a short guy, probably, you know? Get up in here. So, our plan is we might flip the exhaust manifold there. Then we'll have room to, uh... Put some curb scones in Yeah, exactly. So, spoolie boys. You know, if we do twins, we'll then use a get, motion splitter. You get that that uh, butt cheek splitter, you know, <laughs> that goes out 90, 90 out yeah. both sides. One goes here, one comes over here. Flip the exhaust manifold up there. Runner in, hot side. Hot side, hot side up. Hot side up, hot side down. Hot side down, down. right, Cold right side. through the hole there. Cold side will just spin the turbo like right here. Pretty soon, me and Blaine will probably have to take this out. So that's not hard, but that might be our project while Dad finishes that other motor. We may be able to finish it today or tomorrow. We'll see, we'll see. This one went in pretty good. 
need a so fittings. Some fittings. Yeah. Some fittings. Yeah. We don't have the turbos yet, but that's okay. Should I run NA for a minute? Yeah, we'll NA. Go to boost. Yeah. Then we'll have boost season going. Boost season will come up pretty quick. Yeah. But So, we got our factory pulled down for the 
factory computer, which is right here, which we just got out a little bit ago. So it kind of sits down in there, and it's got this little mount. We find it. I think it's in the truck here. Um, meanwhile, I'll what you guys kind of missed a little bit. We pulled the uh, heater core box out because the heater core was leaking. Um, and in the meantime, the computer mounts up there. See these four bolts? There's one right here, one right there, one right here, and then there's two over here. I pulled that whole tray out and we undid some wiring um, to get that out. So we come on back here and we got this little pull down that kind of slides into place. And it holds it in like that. So, what I did was we took this little bracket off, set that over there, we pulled the computer out. Don't really need that. So brought it over here, and there's those little stubs right there. So for our new Holly, Holly Trimmer to your X kit, I just trimmed these little snubs down with a grinder, and we took this guy and set her down in there. And so now it fits pretty snug, a little air, little move, little move, pretty tight right there. Now what we can do, we can nut and just, we can either put nut and bolts through here, or what I haven't tried yet, is this little guy. We can take this little guy and just put him over the top. I think with a little <clears throat> if we bend this down and kind of uh, down in there it should fit pretty good but I think I'm just going to nut and bolt through there because it'll be a little easier and then we got to do one other thing leave this out what we're going to do is maybe slide the computer back so hopefully the plugs can fit through there, but if they don't, what we're gonna do is I made it so if the computer's all the way forward, it doesn't interfere with this bracket right there. That way we can trim this down with a cutoff wheel and then boom, your plugs fit. This comes out here, boom, plugs fit for that. So yeah, that's what we worked on there. Just a quick little cut and grind job. And just like that, with my little, she fits. So now, perfect, here's some hardware. Um, now we can just drill a few holes. We'll mark them on the Terminator X. And then boom, mounted, good to go. All right, Mappo, what are you working on? I just gotta put this little plate, plate back behind me. What's that Close. for? I don't know. I think it's for a throttle cable. What are you doing there? So you're putting that behind the nice motion daughter body? Yeah. Code? Yeah. We're gonna go with the stock truck intake for this thing, cause she makes, she'll get her done, you know? She'll, get her, She'll get her done. So this uh, got our injectors and everything in. Hopefully we can get this thing running by next weekend. We're gonna pull this motor out, leave the headers and everything. Uh, well, we'll take them out, but like um, we're gonna pull this motor out, and that's the motor we're actually gonna run. We're leaving the stock turbo 400 transmission. Um, so that should work. Yeah, I'm working on mounting this in the, wherever the bracket went. Dad is using this grommet. We're gonna put it on the factory Holly, or we're gonna put it on the new Holly harness. Uh, where's the old harness at? Oh, over here. So it had a similar grommet. So we're just gonna use this guy. So we sliced it so we can get the harness in there and then it goes in the truck in that hole and it'll go through the firewall to the computer 
which will be in here. Got all the AC stuff out. And the computer goes up in here. It's kind of dark, but it sits right here. So, yep.